Hello from southwest Hungary, dear OT blowers, and let's discover today this part of the country while driving for about 100 kilometers on the national roads uh, 61 and 68 between the towns of Nagy Kanisha and March. We drive through some peaceful, nice landscape, very relaxing, a good mix of forests and wide open areas, also with some villages on the way. Let's go! We start just near Nagy Kanisa, as uh, the, route, the road 61 starts from the M7 motorway immediately east of the town. Nagy Kanisa is a, a town with a population of about 47,000 inhabitants, situated in uh, Zala County, between the Balaton Lake and the border with Croatia. It developed as uh, an important commercial, uh, on important commercial routes from the Adriatic Sea to Vienna and Budapest, and from uh, Slavonia to Graz. It was an important stronghold during the Middle Ages, the fortress playing a significant uh, role in the southern protection shield of Hungary. Despite its uh, power, it was conquered by the Ottomans in uh, 1600 and occupied uh, by them until 1690. After the Turks were driven out, the castle was demolished and new settlers were uh, brought here of German, Croatian and Serbian origin. The town developed again during the 18th century and started um, a phase of large-scale development in the 1860s. Oil was also discovered here and helped to compensate from the loss of trade importance after the First World War, as Nagy Kanisha became um, a border town. Besides uh, all the buildings in the, in the town center that survived, the town is also a good place for exploring the region around. Palaton Lake is just 40 kilometers away, easily accessible by rail and road via the M7 motorway. And uh, from uh, Nagy Kanisa, we drive through a nice hilly landscape, first uh, direction south for some uh, for about 20 kilometers until turning east. We are on the National Road 61 that we are following until the intersection with the National Road 68 in the village of uh, Bohenie. From here, we took the National Road 68 further, driving southbound to Bac, near the border with Croatia. The drive was very relaxing, as these roads have uh, just light traffic. As the landscape is also pleasant, with small uh, rolling hills and a good mix of forests and wide open areas, I had a great time driving here. And now let's enjoy the drive with some music, and I'll be back in Bac to say some words about uh, this nice small town. Until then, just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Okay. 
ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. Boy. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. Oh, boy. Day we hustle, but the night we. Oh, boy. Know that they ride or die. I'm a oh, boy. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. Boy. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. My name came up a lot of sounds More when I was not around Certain people that I know They ain't no longer about My name came up a lot of sounds More when I was not around Certain people that I know They ain't no longer about My name came up a lot of sounds More when I was not around Certain people that I know They ain't no longer about My name came up a lot of sounds More when I was not around Certain people that I know Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. Oh, boy. They we hustle, but the night we. Oh, boy. Know that they ride or die. Oh, boy. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my seat. These brothers, my guys, know that they fly. Know that they fly. Know that they ride or die. Cold, these brothers, my guys, know that they fly. Know that they fly. Know that they ride or die. CJ Ack, they ain't no longer a bar. They ain't no longer a bar. They ain't no longer a bar.
Once again, hope you enjoyed the relaxing drive through southwest, southwest uh, Hungary. And now let's say a few words about Barč, our destination. Barč is a small town, a border town in Somogi County on the river Drava, uh, on the Hungarian side of the Hungarian-Croatian border. It has a population of about 10,000 inhabitants and has a nice uh, setting surrounded by the Danube Drava National Park. The castle uh, dates back to the 15th century, but was occupied during the 16th century by the Ottoman that uh, kept it until uh, 1660. Uh, Barch is um, during the second uh, half of the 19th century. The town uh, developed a lot until the First World War. And after the war, it became um, a border town and uh, lost most of its importance. During the Soviet occupation, new industry was uh, built here. And uh, nowadays, tourism started also to get pace. People coming here to visit the national park or for uh, trips to discover the nice uh, border region. The main sites uh, in the town include the Roman Catholic Church, dating from 1821, 
the Shechenim Mansion and its park or the Drava Museum. One can take a cruise on the river on the Yamagdar tourist boat starting every Sunday at 2 p.m. and uh, doing a 90 minutes uh, cruise on the Drava River, showing the beautiful nature around the river. Pech is also not uh, far away, about 15 minutes by car. It's a great historical uh, city, former European capital of culture in 2010. And uh, now I'll end the video here in Barch. Hope you enjoyed it and stay tuned for more videos from our road trips here on the channel. Bye bye until the next time.